hello friends see friends what is the problem they have given see a bond of a face value 1000 bears a coupon rate of 10 percent and has a maturity period of a three years okay so face value they have given 1000 coupon rate is 10 percent and maturity is three years okay and based on that they are asking find the value of the bond if the required rate of return is 12 percent if the required rate of return on the bond is 12 percent we have to find the value of the bond next if it is traded that means if the bond is traded in the market at 980 we have to find the ytm that is yield to maturity and third they are asking find the duration if it is expected that a market rate will be 12 percent so if the market rate is 12 percent we have to find the duration okay so in this way we have to solve so friends see here first so such a problems such a problems calculation of the value of the bond that means we have to calculate the present value right we have to find the duration of the bond we have to find the yield to maturity so finding present value duration ytm that can be asked in your exam in abm as well as in bfm okay uh, it is already a part of your jib accounts bond right and this is also the part of abm and bfm under abm they can ask you under the bond bond chapter bond valuation or under the time value of money for this bfm they can ask you under the module b in the bfm risk management okay so remember this is important for your examination now see how to solve it is a very very important to understand how to solve such a problems okay so remember the steps to find the first present value once you able to find the present value of the bond then you are automatically you will easily calculate the duration of the bond okay how see here first find the present value of the bond so first see what is the duration duration is a three year okay that means this is annual right the coupon payable is annually we have nothing mentioned here half yearly or quarterly that means we have to assume it is annually okay so time will be first year second year third year okay so what is the coupon rate coupon rate is 10 percent face value is 1000 that means every year how much you will get 10 percent of 1000 means 100 rupees you are getting every year so first year you are getting cash flow that is the coupon amount 100 for second year you again get 100 and for third year you get again 100 plus the face value that is 1000 rupees face value that means on a third year you will get 1000 as the face value plus 100 coupon that's why that's why i have written for third year the cash flow will be 1100 okay so this is very easy now next you have to find this factor this factor is nothing but the what they have stated we have to find the value when the return is 12 percent when the required return is 12 percent so remember here may this is maximum people do confuse here where they take the coupon amount the coupon rate 10 percent they also take here so remember here first you take time here for cash flow you take a coupon road then then for a next column remember here you have to take the required rate okay so that you have to remember so coupon amount you have calculated using the coupon rate now next is the required rate and required rate they have given 12 percent 12 percent is nothing but simply 0 0.12 removing the percentage sign divide by 100 so what is the factor factor is 1 upon 1 plus r okay so simply 1 upon 1 plus 0 0.12 so it will give you 1 upon 1.12 okay now what you have to do to find these value simply you have to do type in the calculator 1 divided by 1.12 press equal sign you will get the value 0 0.8928 again in the calci press equal sign you will get this value again in the calci press equal sign you will get this value what i have stated remember the steps you have to remember i repeat for calculation of the factor at the rate 12 percent that is 1 upon 1 plus r 
that is nothing but 1 divided by 1 plus r is 12 percent so 0 0.12 so it will be 1 upon 1.12 so to calculate this just type in the calculator 1 divided by 1.12 press equal sign you will get this value again press equal sign you will get this value again press equal sign you will get this value okay so just a press equal sign and write down the value okay now we have calculated this factor now how to calculate present value present value simply multiply that cash flow or you can say coupon amount with these okay that means to calculate the present value just multiply these two column so it is very easy 100 into this you can overly calculate 100 into this you can overly calculate so here you can use the calc 1100 into 0.7117 so you will get 782.87 okay so i repeat how to calculate present value just multiply these value you will get present value okay now do the total of present value do the total of present value means what this plus this plus this you will get 951.86 and that 951.86 is nothing at it is the summation of the present value so it is a total present value so your first answer the the value of the bond if required uh, if required rate is 12 percent answer will be 951.86 so you got first answer okay now we have to find the uh, we have to find the duration also we have to find the duration also right so to calculate duration what you need you need additional this column this column is very easy we have calculated the pv now just multiply present value with the time weightages okay what is time weightage simply here first year second year third year so simply multiply 89.28 into 1 will be 89.28 now 79.71 into 2 you will get 159.49 now this 782.87 multiply by 3 you will get 23.4886 okay so when you get pv into t just do the summation of all you will get total pv into t okay now we are thinking about calculation of a duration so what is duration duration is nothing but summation of a pv into t summation of a pv into t divided by summation of a pv this is simply the formula of duration bond duration okay now here we have already calculated summation of a pv into t this is the total so just put a value divided by summation of a pv that is total present value we have calculated put here so simply divide you will get 2.728 so you can write it 2.73 years so that will be your answer and remember duration is always in the years so 2.73 or 2.72 will be your answer okay so what i have to tell you first i am repeating write down write here time then cash flow or a coupon amount you have to write 10 percent so 10 percent of 1000 face value will be 100 100 each year 100 plus face value at last you will get a full amount your uh, coupon as well as face value so this is the cash flow per year now at this factor you have to calculate 1 divided by 1.12 press equal sign you will get this value again press equal sign you will get again press equal sign you will get so this is your factor now when you multiply a factor with the cash flow or coupon amount you will get the present value do the summation of all the present value to find the duration you need pv into t so pv we have already calculated just multiply by time you will get pv into t pv into t just to do the summation you will get total when you divide pv into t total by the summation of a pv you will get duration okay now we have calculated a first we, uh, the present value we have calculated we have calculated the your duration also now we have to calculate ytm what they are stating if the it is traded in the market at 980 we have to find the ytm now see here how to solve or how to find the ytm so friends this is the formula for approximate ytm or approximate value of ytm can be calculated using this formula now see ytm approximate ytm is equal to your coupon 
प्लस फेस वैल्यू माइनस प्राइस डिवाइडेड बाय एन एंड होल इज डिवाइडेड बाय फेस वैल्यू प्लस प्राइस डिवाइडेड बाय टू ओके सो दिस इज द फॉर्मूला वेयर यू कैन गेट अप्रॉक्स वैल्यू ऑफ वाई टी एंड इन एग्जाम जनरली दे आर आस्किंग अप्रॉक्स वैल्यू ओनली ओके सो यू डोंट नीड टू वरी यू कैन गो विद दी फॉर्मूला ओके नाउ जस्ट पुट अ वैल्यू वट इज कूपन अमाउंट वी वी नो वन थाउजेंड इज दि फेस वैल्यू एंड टेन पर्सेंट इज दि कूपन रेट सो कूपन अमाउंट विल बी हंड्रेड सो हंड्रेड प्लस फेस वैल्यू इज वन थाउजेंड माइनस वट इज द प्रेजेंट वैल्यू दे हेव स्टेटेड इन द क्वेश्चन दैट इट इज ट्रेडिंग मार्केट हियर दे हेव स्टेटेड दे हेव स्टेटेड दि मार्केट प्राइज इज नाइन एट्टी द बॉन्ड इज ट्रेडेड इन ट्रेडिंग इन द मार्केट एट नाइन एटी so your price will be 980 so here p will be 980 so uh, 100 coupon plus 1000 is your uh, face value minus 980 will be your market value divided by n n is nothing but the number of years so 3 is here number of years 3 simply divided by again f plus p uh, put a value here here should be plus okay divided by 2 so when you solve this you will get 10.77 as your answer okay so 10.77 per here here always it is in the percentage okay you can multiply it by 100 okay so you will get percentage 10.77 this is your yield to maturity okay so most important thing is in cib you have to remember that how to calculate the present value you will get definitely a question on present value as well as to find the duration also okay so remember here duration how to calculate first find present value then find pv into d divide pv into d by pv there is summation of pv into d divided by summation of pv you will get the duration okay so friends hope you like this video you can share this video to your friends so that they will be benefited also you can download the application from play store bankers zone cib all the best